about the Billionaires Club. Do you know what the Billionaires Club is? I'm going to pretend you've never heard of what the Billionaires Club is. Do you know what it is? It is a group of people that are in fact billionaires and they donate 99% of their wage to charity. Did you hear me? 99% of their billion dollar wages to charity. I don't know where to start with this. I always wondered why do we have people sitting in front of Coles and Safeway begging for change and asking for money. And originally I thought as well because you're lazy, you know, you don't want to get up every day and get a job or do something that inspires you. You'd rather sit in front of a shop and just ask for money. I've seen these <laughs> sit there all day, ask for change and then go into Coles and buy things that they need. I've seen them with dogs, you know, pets. I've seen them with pets. Why do you have a pet if you can't even feed yourself? I don't really have too much time for charity because I don't really believe that the money goes to the charity that it's directed for or to the people that the charity is designed for as such because I still see homeless people everywhere but I see, you know, 200 charities set up for homeless shelters. How many people are homeless? know how many people are starving I listen to Louise Hayes usually every night before bed just like a quiet meditation kind of thing and one of the things that she says is that people are starving all over the world not because of a lack of food there's plenty of food in the world we throw out so much food but it's because of a lack of love and care we just don't care anymore but apparently this billionaires club does because they donate 99% of their wage, 99%. So the cheapest billionaire, sorry, the poorest billionaire in that club is the, um, the wife, the wife of Apple, Lauren. Lauren Jobs? Lorena. Lorraine Jobs? Lorraine Jobs. I think she's about 18 billion per year. Lorraine is the poorest billionaire and she donates 99% of her wage. Who else is on that list? Bill Gates is on that list. I think he's probably the richest billionaire on that list. What's he make? 90 billion? Mark Zuckerberg from Facebook. Mark Zuckerberg makes $70 billion a year. Jeff Bezos from Amazon. I think he makes about 40 billion. Billion. Not million. He makes 112 billion. He makes 112 billion. Larry Ellison for Oracle. These people are telling us, I'm going to live on one billion dollars a year and I've given, I've given the rest of my money, whatever it may be, to charity. Where, where does that money go? I ask myself the same question, where does that money go? Like, because there's still that guy wherever they're sitting asking for change, but you have donated 99% of your wage to this cause, apparently. So I, I looked into it further and I just, I just asked myself the question, where does your 99% go? And I found that it goes to their own charities. If you look up these people, these billionaires club, Bill Gates, they have their own charity. They've opened up a charity in their own name where they donate this 99%. And I don't know if you're aware of this, but uh, if you donate to a charity, it's a tax write-off. So you don't have to pay any tax. Right? Right off. Right? Right? You don't have to pay any tax. So what's happening in theory is these billionaires in this billionaire club that are making you give your money to them because they're changing the world. They're just doubling up on what they've donated. Donated to their own charities. Look them up. They all have their own charity. They don't donate to programs that actually help people like the Reservoir Neighborhood House with Angie. Angie changes the lives of people every day. These people are donating to themselves, in theory doubling their money. So Miss, uh, Miss Apple, so she donates 19 billion. 
is what you're telling me because it's 99%. But there's that guy sitting there in front of Coles and, or there's that girl that still needs, why am I donating to charity when these people should be fixing the world? Apparently, they're saying, look what I'm doing with all my charity work that I'm doing. I have raised $10 billion, you know, because I donated my wage, you know. It's like the agriculture business. People say to us, shower less, don't wash your car, don't wash your house, don't use water, water crisis. Water comes from the sky. Why are we paying for it? You know, it's not us that are creating this damage to the world. It's the agriculture industry. It's the petrol industry. It's all these other industries, the billion dollar industries. They don't care about you and I. They don't care about humans. They care about profit. And the problem that lies ahead is that there'll be nothing to profit from the way that we're going with how we're destroying the planet every day. It's really disgusting. But the billionaire club, sorry, this was the point I was forgetting. You give me one billion, just one, I think I would fix an entire country. You know, plant a couple of trees, build a couple of wells, build a couple of schools, build a couple of things. You know, we, we shouldn't be starving. We shouldn't have hunger. We shouldn't have poverty. Poverty shouldn't exist. Hunger shouldn't exist. These problems shouldn't exist, especially with the billionaire club in place. I knew that you wanted it by the way you were looking.